Hello, and here we are today underneath the Wembley Arch at one of the most instantly recognisable venues in the football world. I'm Derek Ray, and joining me to provide expert analysis is Stuart Robson. And without doubt, a match with the potential to bring genuine excitement. It's England up against Finland. Well, Derek, as is always the case, the team that dominates midfield would be the team that controls the flow of the game. And that, for me, is the area that's key today. The England first 11. Jordan Pickford stands between the posts. Luke Shaw starts with Kyle Walker as fullbacks. Raheem Sterling plays with Phil Foden out wide. And the responsibility of leading the line today goes to Harry Kane. This is the lineup for the visitors today. Well, on paper, it looks a fairly cautious approach because unless their wing backs can get into more advanced areas, I'm not sure where the attacking width will come from. And so the battle commences. Well, strong play here. Now Harry Kane on the move. Well, that takes the wind out of their sails. Great defending. Fuki. Individual brilliance. And a goal! Not wasting much time today. They strike first. Well, here we can see it again. Look at the way he glides past the defender to create space for himself. And the finish is just as good. That's an excellent goal. So, action underway again. And the onus is certainly on England to find a reply now. Harry Kane. Mount, Declan Rice, Sterling has it, How can they make one of these passes count, good strength to keep the ball, Rice with it, Foden, given away by England, Kamara, Oh, Jan Palu. Excellent use of the ball as they make their way forward. Well, nothing comes of it. It looked promising. And Kane saw his pass intercepted. Kamara. 
Uronen. Can they convert? And denied by the keeper. Impressive. Shaw. Rice with it. Here's Luke Shaw. Kane. Sterling. Here's Mount. Rice. A very timely interception. An example of how to press. It's a weighted pass. The end product just wasn't there. Phillips. Here's Mount. Kane. Oh, a lovely incisive pass. And it's a goal. Level again. What a match this is turning out to be. Well, here it is again, and credit to the goal scorer. But you have to ask questions of the keeper. He's got to have that near post cover for me. No wonder he's frustrated with himself. So back on the way. One goal apiece here. James Favre. Kamara. Spav on the ball. Lut. They know they need to stop him. Puki. Effective challenge. A move of promise on the flank. Well, here's the replay, and what a well-delivered cross this is. Perfectly placed, and it makes the striker's job so easy. All he has to do is make the right connection. It's a lovely goal. Well, as they kick off again... 2-1, the current state of affairs. Jona Toivio. Here's Paulus Arayuri. Not far from the ideal pass. Declan Rice moving the ball effectively looking for the right moment I just couldn't play that decisive ball Temo Puki surely the equaliser teammate in support Well, that's how to put in a clean tackle. Calvin Phillips. Foden. In position. And there it is. An almost intuitive piece of finishing.
Well, let's take another look at this. From the attacking point of view, everything is right. The shot across the goalkeeper making it difficult for him. Players coming in for the rebound. It's an excellent goal. And the keeper could do nothing about it. It's a tale of four goals in this match now. 3-1 it is. Kamara. Blood. Well, can they prize them open now? Puki. Opportunity. Well, as the replay shows us, this is the way to beat tight marking. Just look how he turns with the ball. That's a fantastic goal, you have to say. You can't really say defences are on top. 3-2. Calvin Phillips. Foden. Mount. And he's outdone himself. Wonderful save there. Short corner taken. Is it going to be Raheem Sterling? And a fine stop to turn the ball away. Plays it back. And a tidy challenge. Well, that save has kept them in this game. They now need to create one or two chances of their own. I'm not sure why the fans are so upset. I think the referee got that absolutely right. A meaty but fair challenge, and it will be a throw-in. Good tackle, it'll be a throw. Joel Poyanfalo. Oh, good vision. Well, far too much elevation there. Declan Rice Phillips Phil Foden now Calvin Phillips England moving the ball forward what can they do from here Kane and it's gone in just what the doctor ordered things looking very bright for them now with this buffer Well, here's the replay, and he shows great awareness to play this through ball. And when he gets onto it, he decides to go for power. It's a really emphatic finish, which gives the keeper no chance. So the current scoreline, 4-2. Inching towards the interval, and it's going with home advantage. Stewart, as always, very keen to get your take. Well, they're dominating this first half. Their approach play, their cleverness around the box, and the finishing have been excellent. They just need to continue this going into the second period. Oh, Jan Palo. 
And England come away with it. Mount. Oh, it might be. Goalkeeper getting in the way. Superb save. The short corner routine. Cuts it back. Still alive. Well, good defending. Clattered out of there. Keeper getting the touch. And in the end, no damage done. Well, those stats tell you everything. They're opening up the opposition at will. And while we've seen some really poor defending, their attacking play has been excellent. The referee has instructed the fourth official to put two minutes on the board. Blood. Sparve on the ball. Under pressure. Doesn't seem to be bothering him. He made it look simple, really. And there it is, the half-time whistle. Well, a really terrific outing from Harry Kane so far. Truly making his presence felt, Stuart. Well, he's found so much space today, and he's used it really well. He's been their creative spot, and he's got a very good goal as well. He's been excellent. The two teams have switched around and are ready now for the second half. Making progress. But they dealt with the threat first. Blood. Buki. Poyan Palo. And scope for them to produce something exciting. Oh, he's given the ball away. Pookie. Difficult to stop him. Wonderful challenge, and a throw-in coming up. How about the cross? Lodge, perfectly positioned to take it away. And the conditions look pretty good for the counter-attack. And smart defending. For Jan Palo. Well, he's thwarted him almost effortlessly. Foden. And now Stones. Now Harry Kane on the move. But they took care of the situation defensively. Joel Poyanpalo. 
but attacking possibilities excellent challenge Phillips and Mount moving the ball effectively Sterling and that's gone out of play for what will be a goal kick Time for a change then. Well, it's been quite clear that England have been second best in terms of possession, but their attacking play has been really incisive. It's been a really good display from them so far. Rice. Kane. Teammate available. Can he put it away? In it goes! He's made it a brace for himself. No stopping him, apparently. Well, here we can see it again, and no wonder the manager is furious. They just have to get tighter here, deal with the danger, otherwise that's the outcome. Not good enough defensively. And so the action continues with England very much bossing this game. Uroden. So a half an hour remaining. Toivio. Jensen. Kamara. Frederick Jensen. Dangerous looking attack. Has someone to play it to. And a very good challenge. Declan Rice. And now Stones. Harry Kane waits. Good work to win it back high up the pitch. Temo Puki. And the quality of pass needs to be a bit better. Now can they counter clinically? Sterling. Kamara. On the ball, Robin Lott. It's a perfect challenge. Walker. And plenty of scope to be creative in that wide position. But really sticking to the task defensively. Frederick Jensen. Temo Puki. Uronen. Well, we have 20 minutes left in this game. Mount. Now Harry Kane. Declan Rice. Harry Kane. Kane. 
A real opening now. A goal! And I'll tell you what, on this sort of form, very few would lay a glove on them. Well, here it is. 1v1 against the keeper, and the outcome was never really in doubt. He never looked like missing that. And as they restart the game, it's fair to say the gulf in quality between the two sides has been huge. Blood. Arayuri. Well, on the cusp of the final whistle and the home side really prospering today. Stuart, interested to get your take. Well, what can you say about this performance? They've been absolutely brilliant. They've played with such guile and creativity, and their passing has been so expansive. Not many teams would have stopped them today. Foden. A chance for them to provide a test in the form of a corner. Who can he pick out? Well, thumped clear. Could be troublesome. And now Dominic Carvert-Lewin. Can they do something positive on the counter-attack? Good-looking ball. Could be dangerous. In position. He cuts it back. He'll be breathing a sigh of relief. Ball one. Mount. And now Stones. Using his physical strength to make sure he doesn't lose the ball. Declan Rice. And unable to keep the ball. Raitala. Puki. Holding on to the ball, waiting for the cavalry to arrive. Mount. Declan Rice. And breaking at pace with Menace. Foden. Good physical play. Jona Toivio. Uronen. It's with Jensen. Lot. Decent position. I'm giving the ball away. And making use of his physical strength to hang on to it. Strength and control, a big part of his game. Well, a bit wasteful from England. Oh, a perfectly timed pass. Almost found its target, but cutting it out in the end. Blood. Frederick Jensen. Now for Jan Palo. Crossing possibilities. Corner coming up.
The referee has decided that two additional minutes are in order. This is looking threatening. Now just the tackle that was needed. Good strength to keep the ball. Foden. Shaw. Here's Mount. And there it is, the final whistle. And the fans will be leaving the stadium with smiles on their faces. You're absolutely right, Derek. Their attacking play was excellent, full of energy and pace, and the midfield completely dominated the game. It was a great all-round performance. As usual, Harry Kane, difficult to defend against. What did you make of what he actually did out there on the pitch? Well, he did everything today. His energy, skill and movement was just too good for those defenders. It was a really good display. Foden, in position, and there it is, an almost intuitive piece of finishing. Well, can they prize them open now? Fuki, opportunity, and it's in, this game very much back on as a contest. England moving the ball forward. What can they do from here? And it's gone in. Just what the doctor ordered. Things looking very bright for them now with this buffer. Teammate available. Can he put it away? In it goes. He's made it a brace for himself. No stopping him apparently. Harry Kane. Kane. A real opening now. A goal! And I'll tell you what, on this sort of form, very few would lay a glove on them.